Hi everyone, this is Kale Hope, and I'm just going to uh, make a quick video here uh, to demonstrate uh, Instant Twitter Lock. It's a great WordPress uh, plugin. Um, let's go through it. So basically, what it does is it locks different content um, and rewards a visitor to your site or blog. Um, by having them tweet out a message uh, in order to earn things like coupons um, or ebooks or uh, any kind of download, maybe you have a music download, um, you might have some kind of content, um, some kind of prize or reward um, for getting your site out, your name, your tweet customized to whatever you want um, and when each person logs in with their Twitter account they're broadcasting your message in order to get this content so by making something very meaningful um, that is worth tweeting out your page or your message um, it's a great way to driving social traffic um, to your site or blog so I've set up this uh, demo page and I'm going to go through all the features with you um, what I've done here for this is I've just simply created a uh, a simple banner um, for basically free Twitter design and this will be the content that I want to lock because it's a limited time only promotion. I've been doing all kinds of um, graphic design for Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, um, on different um, micro job uh, websites like Fiverr and so forth. Um, so this is a great way of um, promoting uh, a free design for a limited time um, for a new site that I am launching which is essentially to house my uh, social media marketing services and uh, and promote basically uh, social networking and search engine optimization or SEO so um, let's get on with it and uh, we'll start um, first off you can still make the banner clickable as well so if I click on this for example uh, what it will do is it should go right to my squeeze page so maybe you have a product or a service that you want to uh, promote a lot of guys on um, WSO love things like this so of course this is also great on the squeeze page because uh, the information Entered basically goes into a newsletter, and as a lot of people say, the money is in the list. Well, it can't be any truer than this. So let's go back to WordPress here. I'll go into my dashboard. So when you install the plugin, which is really simple, it's like installing any other WordPress plugin. You put it into your uh, WP uh, hyphen content folder, and inside that folder, you'll see your themes uh, folder as well as your plugins folder. Um, so what you're going to do is simply take the zipped up folder um, for this plugin um, which would be just instant uh, Twitter on lock unzip it uh, drag that folder using your file transfer protocol or FTP client uh, or your website um, site manager you go through there and you simply put that into the plugins folder so that's um, WP hyphen content folder and inside that folder you'll see your plugins folder drop it in there you'll see all your plugins in there next thing you'll have to do is you go into uh, your plugins in WordPress so that's going to be typically WP hyphen admin after your domain URL or subdomain URL 
and uh, then what you'll do is you'll find the plugin and right here of course I already have it activated so uh, I'll deactivate it and then, and then run it so we'll go step by step through it so you activate the plugin and the next thing that you'll be doing is you'll simply go into the options here which these are your tweet locks so you can add a new one or you can go into all tweet locks by default there is a default uh, Twitter lock I have one set up simply for the demo page um, so let's use the actual um, default option here so right here you can put in your uh, the URL for to be tweeted out to each person so put in HTTP colon forward slash forward slash um, this is going to differ for you for me I'm putting in my main domain so this is for my personal blog and then uh, in tweet content what you're doing is putting in a, a quick description this is within the uh, character limit for Twitter so let's see here uh, this is probably not going to be the best description but um, let's try uh, check out this awesome WordPress plugin I found. Okay, and as you can see, we have tweet to unveil the content. So, of course, this is all in a live demo here so for example if I wanted to change that to instead of tweet to unlock or tweet to reveal this content how about tweet to unlock and of course your styling red let's change that so instead of red let's check out black it's pretty good I'm gonna go with blue because the theme I have for this new page is blue and then we'll go down here and you have three tabs um, let's go over the functions here right now it has a close button on so basically instead of having to tweet um, your message visitors can actually just bypass that by closing that so I'm gonna switch that off and you can also set like a time interval so like I said it's a it's a live preview so if I want to set it to not 50 seconds but 60 seconds so it does a countdown and once that uh, timer interval gets to zero it will display your message I'm gonna leave that blank because by default that just eliminates that um, highlights on this is just kind of a a highlighted effect for it I'm gonna leave that on I'm gonna leave on uh, the divining for um, mobile devices here and yes there's three tabs so let's go to that so you have your Twitter button and there's a count box so here's what that is it shows how many times it's been tweeted I kinda like that on and then of course you have English for the language by default uh, for me and you can have your screen name 
which is a tribute to the Tweet 2 and related accounts. You can specify related accounts to show after tweeting and you can separate them with a comma. I don't need that. Um, account URL, the URL to which your shared URLs resolve. Uh, I don't really need that. Um, they'll basically just come in from the different um, different people that tweet it so I'm not going to do that. The third one is a nice bonus here that um, triggers an unlock event. You can just add your JavaScript code and that will simply execute the function when um, someone clicks on the button to tweet your URL. Um, and then it will of course just unlock your content. So the next thing that we're going to do is go over how to define this content and, and lock it. So um, what I'm going to do is actually update this. And this is just on the uh, default Twitter locker. And so the next part I need to do is go into either, um, this works on both posts, but I'm not adding this to posts. I, I kind of have this blogging platform locked down and using it less as a blog and more as a content management framework for it. Um, so yes, yeah, so I'm just using it as a content management system or CMS. So you don't have to do it for posts. You can also do this for pages. So I'm just going to go into uh, the demo page and because it's already created and published, uh, I'm just going to simply find that. So I've already actually tried this out. Um, so that's why this Twitter code's already in there. And of course, it's the same uh, text editor system that you would find with just putting in regular blogging content. So, in your posts, for example, or in, in creating new pages um, for your WordPress blog, you can easily just um, insert your content accordingly, upload an image. Uh, I also have a URL and that's to go to the squeeze page of course. So I'm going to select the content. So this is the image, my banner. And uh, you'll notice up here a new option and this is the split button. You go down and you can pick which lock you want in the corresponding code to it. So I'm not going to use the demo Twitter locker because I've already put in my Twitter details and unlocked it. So I haven't with the default Twitter locker so that's why for this I'm doing that. And as you can see it puts into it um, right here is the um, just the tags used for to uh, define whatever's inside is what the lock content is. So you'll notice the other elements such as up here where I have a title bolded and um, you have down here uh, the rest of the, the blog post or, or uh, page content here. Um, so just in between, so this starts at tweet block tag and um, slash tweet log which is to close that that information so I'm going to click update now and what I'm going to do is simply uh, preview that page It's going to just load up the demo page for me. And as you can see, right here, we have our account. It shows that it needs to be tweeted to unlock it. And here I'm going to bring this up. And right away you'll see your message that we defined 
um, in WordPress. So this just simply says, check out this awesome WordPress plugin I found, and it shows the URL. And um, I'm not going to tweet that, um, just because that's going to go to my main site, and then people are going to be looking for the WordPress um, plugin there. But this basically, in a nutshell, um, will show you uh, how this works, and I hope that you've learned a little bit, and um, you know, make sure that you comment, rate, subscribe um, to my YouTube channel. This is where this will be posted at. And peace.